Our next story is another example of individuals helping animals in trouble. Welcome to Bunny Love, a nonprofit, all volunteer rabbit welfare organization that has rescued thousands of bunnies over the past few years. Come on, Tiny, would you like some breakfast? All of the rabbits who you see here today have been rescued from municipal shelters where they would have been euthanized if we hadn't taken them. I would say almost all of them have parasites of some kind. Um, parasites can generally be very mild, but if neglected, they can be fatal. We take a lot of rabbits who are in serious trouble from these really simple problems. Most of the problems are just simply due to neglect and lack of information. The rabbits will be bald just from lack of nutrients. Their hair will all fall out. A lot of rabbits have problems with their feet infections and splayed feet and, and toes from living in cages, very poor digestive health, which is the foundation of a, of a healthy rabbit. Some have been attacked by other animals. Um, some have just been forgotten about. So they all come in with their own challenges, but they respond so well to care and love that in no time at all, they're happy and healthy and carefree. Little Miss Jaja, you can tell, she is a fuzzy lop who just got a haircut because she came into the shelter so badly matted, she couldn't even walk because her legs were just completely webbed to her body. Um, and it, it, all the fur had torn holes and she had a bunch of sores under her skin. Um, so she's very happy now. She, she shows us how happy she is by wagging her tail at us all the time. A little crystal here was found in a field um, Dumped in, a, dumped in a soccer field. Josie, hiding under the chair there, we actually found her um, last summer in the middle of an extreme heat wave uh, running around a parking lot. And she was so dehydrated, um, it, it, it took quite a while to get her back in shape. For the staff of Bunny Love, caring for these cute creatures is a passion and a commitment they don't take lightly. Typically we will bring in a rabbit from a shelter. Usually they are just a few months past puberty. Most people when they get baby bunnies, they're just these cute little innocent balls of fluff and almost overnight they become teenagers and nobody knows what to do with them or that they can be neutered and everything will be fine. So the shelters are typically packed with newly adolescent rabbits. Um, we bring them in, we watch them for a week or two, we get them on a good diet. Once we feel they're healthy and you know if we haven't observed any other medical problems we go ahead and we get them neutered or spayed and then within about four weeks after that they're, they're litter box trained and healthy and ready to go and then people who have adopted in the past or people who are just finding us, if they have one or two or three rabbits and they want to increase their family, they will bring their rabbits in and we do bunny bonding. Owning a rabbit is a big responsibility and a lot of work. And the caring people at Bunny Love remind visitors all the time that rabbits are not for everyone. But when one of these rescued critters is adopted, it makes all their efforts worthwhile. Well, it's terrific. It's the best that we can do for them. Even just watching them, some of them don't know how to be rabbits. And even in our care, we watch them explore hay for the first time, or we watch them interact with other rabbits for the first time, or we watch them, you know, very uh, carefully creep out of their cage and watch to see if anybody's going to, you know, put them back in. They're, they dance for the first time and they look around to make sure it's okay. It's, it's so rewarding. It's so rewarding. They, they deserve all of that joy and so many of them have been robbed of that and we get to give it back. We'll have more of Animal Rescue right after this brief break. <laughs> 